back here with another video, and today we're going to be uh, doing an unboxing of this new hard drive that I just bought. Uh, it's an 8 terabyte Seagate, I believe. I hope it is. Uh, it's right here, so uh, let's go ahead and let's check it out. I uh, got my handy dandy knife here. Let's get into it. See you guys when I open this big ass box. Alright, so here it is. Just open it up. I got my receipt here. Don't want that. Oh, shit. Doing this one hand. Get it. Oh, come on. Oh. Damn it. It's okay. Calm down. So this is it here, guys. We got a 8 terabyte Seagate expansion baby here. Because uh, your boys... Your boy's little hard drive right there is running out, and yeah, I gotta drop it. Oh shit! But uh, uh, yeah. So that's that's my hard drive right there. Using a flashlight for some light to see how that's going. But we got this big boy here, uh, bigger than my old one. So let's go ahead and open it and see what we get inside. So this is everything that comes in. We got the big beauty, the eight terabyte hard drive here. We got it looks to be a USB cord and the power supply. Cause this big boy here runs on an external power supply. So yeah, I'm actually downloading a mod, or else I have the plate remove my thing there. But. Let's go ahead and do a size. Look at that guy. This is my WD 2 terabyte hard drive. I have a channel on that unboxing if you want to check it out. And this is my new boy here. Uh, gonna have to swap everything over to this guy, 8 terabytes, because I uh, don't need that 2 terabyte anymore. I'm gonna show you guys how to set it up. If you want to watch that, it'll be in the later on in this video. But this one just runs off a single cord, doesn't need the other shit. But, uh, Let's get to setting this up, shall we? Alright guys, so now we're on the Xbox. As you can see here, we're running on that Xbox one. Uh, I believe this works the same as PS4. Just a different menu and all that. So, uh, as you see here, I have my old hard drive still in here. It says external storage ready. I'm about to plug that other one in, but I'm going to show you uh, what it low-key looks like. So if you go over down here to, I believe, storage, where it says system. And you can see this is my two terabyte here, the one that says 99% used. That's my internal, which is a 500 gig regular old Xbox. Uh, yeah, I was completely full on that. I'm about to transfer everything over to the eight terabyte. I plan on getting maybe another one. So when I get that Xbox One X, I'll be running a total of 17 gigs, 17 terabytes, because I know it comes with the one terabyte internal and then two eight terabytes. My math's correct, boom. Because I know you could run at least two uh, hard drives on there. I would like to just max that out on space so I don't have to ever upgrade it ever again. Uh, I believe this one was only 160 so I'll probably buy another one down the road, maybe. I don't know if I'll still be playing games by then. Maybe. But, uh, uh, so let's go ahead and just uh, let's plug it in. Go back to the menu. Let's plug it in. Uh, plug it in that last thing. Alright, the hard drive is up and spinning. I can see it, a blue light has turned on. It's making a lot of fucking vibration noises. Uh, don't know if I plugged this in right, let's see. Let's go down to storage. Do I have to maybe take out my old hard drive? Oh, here it is, this is the menu. All right, boys and girls. So, this is what it's gonna look like. Um, when you plug your new hard drive, it might take a little bit, maybe not. My Xbox is old, who cares? Uh, so it's going to ask now, I guess, because before you just said just a format. So now it says you can use for media or for games and apps. If you choose an external storage for media, music, videos, and pictures, you'll keep any content currently on this drive. If you choose to use this game for apps, you'll need to reformat it, blah, blah, blah. So after everything I get about 7.2 gigs so it looks like you get about 14.2 if you get two of them 14.4 so we're gonna go ahead and format we'll name this hard drive just external 
Once the thing pops up, yeah, we just keep it external, really don't care. And then I'm just gonna install the new things on here so that it stays. So we're gonna format that. It's gonna take maybe a couple seconds. Let's see where it's at. Yeah, I was desperate to use this. I had like 99 games installed. I have some more games waiting to install. Uh, but let's see. Is it uh, formatting? Let's go down to storage. Yep, there it is. Whoo, look at that space, boys and girls. 7.3 terabytes free. So now my thing is I got to transfer everything from this external onto this external here. So that's pretty much how you uh, reset up, how you set up a new hard drive for your Xbox One. This works for all hard drives from WD to Seagates, from whatever. As long as it's USB 3.0, you should be good be good to go so then yeah plug it in plug and play simple as that uh yeah guys be sure to just like and share these videos and subscribe if you want to stay up to more content see you guys in my next video